Master. Oh God. Ah. Ah. Camera. Hi guys, we have a good one today. Um, our buddy Josh from our camp that we fish with, he brought us out to one of the private ponds that he's able to fish, and it looks it looks pretty sweet. We have an aerator right there, like I don't know, 40 yards that way. I put on a tip up Kenny, he's doing stuff right now, but uh, we haven't caught no fish yet, but we're just starting out, so it should be fun. So uh, keep watching. What's in the box of goodies today? This is my rod. It's a 32 inch medium uh, dead meat rod. Got the really really light tip. I got this fire tiger tungsten jig on there. What would look good with that? Them little guys look cute. It's a rocking looking panfish bait. Thirteen incher. Yeah. God, first crappie. It's a tank too. That is sweet. It's a freaking bucket mouth. Never been so excited to drop a vexlar into a hole in my whole life. Okay, here we got about 16 feet of water. I'm hooked up. Nice perch, look at that. All right, that's like the perfect size eater I'd say for a perch. Yeah, look at the colors in that thing. It's just beautiful. Get him off. And just... These are crap. These are freaking six feet off the bottom. Oh, ho, ho! they got a big seed. Oh, yeah, that's what they are. Huge. Look at that. These are, in my opinion, like some of the most beautiful fish out there. That's my first one of the year. It's a nice seed, but you know what? Because they're a rarity and all. Right. And I never catch them. I'm gonna put them back. What's up, dude? Beautiful, beautiful. All right, Kenny has a flag, so we're gonna check this out. Just swim right there, didn't it? Let's see if he's on there. Try something small. Something big. Is it? Yeah. Wait. Something nice. Oh my goodness, that is humongous, Jesus. That thing is freaking enormous. That's one of those green sunfish too. It don't really get very big, but that is impressive. God dang. Oh, 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 oh. All right, maybe the wind knocked this one off, but it's gonna hurt to check. Nice too. Like a walleye? Like a small walleye. Oh my god. Oh my. Those are so big. So I mean, those are big, big, big fish. Wow. God, those are two beautiful fish. Look at the colors on those things. Kenny's got something good on him. What are you doing? Woo! Oh my god. Ah. 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 What do you got? Oh. Oh my goodness. It's a nice one. Choked that thing too. Nice fish, Kenny. Woo! What's that? Uh? 18, 19? He's healthy. Hey. That's sick. one of these big hybrid bluegills or sunfish or whatever they are. They are cool looking dudes. Gosh, nice. And he has another nice fish. Josh, I got a big one. 
Yeah. Oh, it's a big, oh, it's big largey. That's why it felt big. The bass. Zipping around. Look at that guy. He's only maybe what, a pound and a quarter, probably? That's a nice fish. Oh, God, yeah. Josh, the bass guide. Look at those cold water colors in that thing. What a beautiful fish. Here you go. I think it's freaking enormous. I've never caught this many big fish in my entire life. It's insane. But this, I mean, they're all this size. It's insane. So we're going to keep some. Uh, the landowner said we can't keep any walleyes. And it's kind of cool. Um, there are six tiger muskies in this pond. And we got tips out, but we got monofilament or fluorocarbon leaders with that six pounds. So unless we hook them in the snout, we ain't catching no tiger muskies. But I mean, it's just cool to think about we're fishing on a, on a body of water with muskies in it. So. They got a fish. Another big bluegill. It's pretty rare where you could say you've uh, got on like a, a bite where you're just getting huge, huge bluegills on minnows, on tip ups. It's insane. Jesus criminy. This is insane. Oh, that's a slab. Slab city. Hand line on the tip up. You know, let's get darker. I switched baits to like a bigger profile. It's a spoon with a minnow head, so hopefully big crappies, big walleyes. I've been catching tons of little crappies, but nothing big yet, so hopefully that's the move to make. Big fish on! Big fish on! Come on, Kenny, help me with the camera! It's a big fish, Kenny. It is. I haven't gained an inch on it yet. Why didn't you just reach underneath his belly and pull him out of the hole instead of trying to do your can? Son of a 27 inches. Why are you doing that? Hey guys, I'm sorry I had to end like that. Um, sorry for the, the language. But uh, things don't always go as you plan. Usually I'm pretty lucky when I'm filming. I never lost anything like big in my life, but that was very close to the biggest wall I've ever hooked in my entire life and had my hands on it and I dropped it on the hole my arm is still soaked from that ordeal but um we really film an outro because uh it's really really dark outside and the GoPros suck at night but uh hope you guys enjoyed that those are some giant 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 panfish I'm not even sure what they are exactly but they weren't bluegills they weren't sunfish they were like some sort of hybrid they were just enormous and they were eating whatever you put down there and it was, it was so fun we got bass those panfish, uh, crappies, and Kenny caught a nice walleye, and um, I lost the, the giant. But uh, hope you guys enjoyed that, and hope you guys have a good day. Thanks.